you've been through Why you got scars Since you walked through the door I've been trying to reach you Cause I feel you What's the story to tell? What's the story behind? The mountain you're trying to climb Think of her Welcome back to the channel, or if you are brand new here and this is the very first time you ever see on my face, what's up? I am Jen. I share all things health and wellness here on the channel. Anything I do to level up my own life, I share with you guys in hopes to inspire and motivate you to do the same. So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video. Alrighty guys, we have another week's grocery haul and meal plan video coming at you. Where did we hit up this week? We did Walmart, we did Aldi's, we did Target. All the same usual suspects to pick up all the things that we need to keep us trucking along on our health journey, feed the crew, keep us all thriving here at the house. I was gonna actually have a crock pot video going up for you guys today. However, I still have a couple yummy meals that I want to film and I ended up switching some dinners around. So that video should be coming next week. I know you guys are wanting to see that. We are full into crock pot season right now and I am absolutely loving making all the crock pot dinners. They make life so easy. But we're not gonna gab a ton. If you wanna see what we picked up, just keep watching. Walmart's up first. We spent 130 bucks at Walmart diving right in got some of the black forest great value ham this is the thin sliced normally get the turkey but decided to switch it up a little bit and go with the ham this week we have hit the mother load again for the third straight week in a row with the caramel apple light and fit greek yogurts y'all these are bomb.com i actually had some of this last night with the other granola not the trader joe's one i've been telling you guys about that honey crisp apple from trader joe's is 10 out of 10 but i had it with the Members Mark granola that I get from Sam's Club, and it was just as good. So we are loving that. Got some chocolate rice cakes. Tried to get some last week. They were out of stock, so we went ahead and grabbed some this week. Stocked up on the Jiffy Corn Muffin Mix, because this is my go-to cornbread. They're only like 49 cents a box. And I use a ton of this through the holiday season, too, so I decided just to stock up and grab six boxes, so I have it on hand. Got some of the reduced sugar dried cranberries. Going to be adding some of these in different salads. Macros are 100 calories for a quarter cup, which is 40 grams. But they're really awesome in the chicken salad I make, or just to kind of sprinkle in some other salads absolutely delicious and these are the 50 percent less sugar value pack so it's a bigger bag that will last forever grab some of the joseph's pita bread these are awesome for sandwiches or a ton of different things grab two of the smithfield slow roasted golden rotisserie flavored fresh pork tenderloin going to be making some yummy sheet pan dinners with these picked up a chuck tender roast and it is still well within date but it looks like a little off color a little bit to me i don't know it's not really showing up perfectly or i'm maybe just paranoid because i get really weirded out by stuff like that and there's like a shadow from the camera but i'll have hubby check it out hopefully it's good because you guys know that crock pot mississippi pot roast is my jam got some more turkey pepperonis Picked up some of these little butter tasting biscuits. These are the little small five packs. They're 100 calories for one biscuit for our Brenner this week. This two pack of block Philadelphia cream cheese was on a sale. It was like a couple dollars off. I forget now off the top of my head what the price was. If I remember, I'll try to pop it up on the screen here. But I use this a ton through the holidays for baking also. So I went ahead and just snagged it just to have in the fridge. And these I am super pumped about. This is the honey butter Philadelphia cream cheese. My girl Nicole showed this in one of her last videos and I immediately ran straight to Walmart to see if they have it in stock. A lot of the flavored cream cheeses are out of stock often so when I saw it there I was like yes let me grab two of these because I know that's going to be bomb. 70 calories this serving, two tablespoons, honey butter. I just know that will be delicious on my cinnamon raisin bagels which they were out of stock of in Walmart but I will grab some from Target or somewhere. We still have a few. Dave's Killer Bread cinnamon raisin bagels have literally been my obsession lately and I know that'll be bomb on there. Picked up some of the great value egg whites for meal prep this week some Campbell's French onion soup for a crock pot recipe some more Parmesan cheese because we were out as well as Daisy light sour cream Chick-fil-a for the kiddos also for the kiddos some apple cinnamon Cheerios cereal smart food popcorn for the little guy some beefy onion soup mix and then some regular onion soup mix both for two different crock pot meals some more of the great value original beef jerky the kids have been flying through this like crazy so I am keeping that stocked Hamburger buns for the kids, strawberry applesauce for the little guys' lunches, as well as Lunchables. So that is everything from Walmart this week. Small little Target haul up next. We actually ended up needing some more lunch meat for some meal prep. So I got the Good and Gather Ultra Thin Black Forest Ham and some of the Honey Ham so that we could finish out meal prep. Then I also picked up a pack of the Low Fat Breakstones Cottage Cheese just so we could add it to whatever we wanted for cooking, meal prep, 
or whatever other kind of fruits we wanted. Plus, this is like $3.29 for this four pack. This is now up to like two bucks for one of these. So I picked up this one for my daughter to try and then went ahead and just got the four pack for us for the rest of the week. Got some Alfredo sauce for a crock pot meal, some of the sea salt caramel chocolate crunch Yasso Greek yogurt bars because they are delicious, 150 calories for one and they are bomb. Some more of the Fair Life milk and then three bags of the Quest protein chips. They had a deal for spin 25, I believe, and you got a $5 gift card and I was already getting some of these. So it worked out. We picked up two of the barbecue and one of the loaded taco. I really love the variety pack on Amazon, but since they were having this deal and it was quicker, I just went ahead and picked them up from Target. So that's a few things that we got from Target. Diving into all these, we spent $67 there. Always stock up on the produce and berries there which are a way better deal at Aldi's right now because you guys know these prices, especially for blueberries, are just off the Richter scale right now. So grab two of the blueberries and they look awesome. Some zucchinis, some strawberries don't look the absolute best, but definitely a better deal at Aldi's. Picked up some of the green seedless grapes from Aldi's. You know we've been getting the big one from Sam's. This is about half the size, but it will work. We've been flying through the grapes. Got some reduced fat Mexican style cheese, some of my favorite cherub tomatoes for meal prep this week. Of course, the Mediterranean herb salmon. It's our absolute favorite. If you have an Aldi's by you, 10 out of 10 recommend. Picked up two of those. Got some boneless skinless chicken breasts. I am going to cut this up and portion it out into a couple different dinners. Some dry Italian salami for my daughter's meal prep. Some onions cornstarch that I need for one of the crock pot recipes, some bananas, and then I got a few goodies from online, which I'm super pumped about. I got some of First Form's new energy drinks. They just came out with the two new flavors. This is the Tropical Lightning and the Screaming Freedom. I've already thrown a couple in the fridge. I'll keep you guys posted on how I like those, but I'm super pumped for those. Got some more of my Opti Greens and some more of the Micro Factor Pack. I know I always get questions about what's in here. And it's got antioxidants, essential fatty acids, fruits and veggies, capsule, CoQ10, and a multivitamin, and a probiotic. It's got all the daily essential nutrients that you need right there in one convenient pack. If you bought all of these separately, especially good quality ones, it would end up costing you way more. So I absolutely love the convenience of the pack, having everything that I need right in there. And then from Amazon, I picked up some of this trivia sweet brown sugar for baking and little guys oatmeal. It was cheaper to get on Amazon than it was in Walmart so I just went ahead and got it from there and it would have had to have been shipped from Walmart anyways. So getting it from Amazon was a little bit cheaper and it came faster. So that was the only thing I got from Amazon this week. Now we'll go ahead and jump into the meal plan. Jumping into this week's meal plan. Of course we have a few crock pot meals that we are loving and I am filming for you guys. Monday is the good old Mississippi pot roast which you guys know it just stays in the rotation week after week because it's delicious. Tuesday will be fish tacos. Wednesday will be leftovers. Thursday will be an incredibly easy crock pot meal. I will be throwing that in the crock pot video for you guys because it's just super simple and I want to have as many simple ones thrown in there as possible. So crock pot tortellini and chicken alfredo will be coming to you guys. Friday we'll be doing a sheet pan dinner with the pork tenderloin. Saturday will be for leftovers and then Sunday will be another crock pot dinner, the french onion chicken, which is another one I am super excited about. We love all the crock pot meals. They just make life easier. They make leftovers awesome and it's the perfect time of year for all the crock pot yumminess. So that'll do it for this week's meal plan. If you guys enjoy these videos, seeing what we pick up at the grocery stores every week and the meals that we have in the dinner rotation, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. Share it with anybody else you think it may be helpful to. I appreciate it when you guys do. And of course, throw any of your favorite yummy dinners or crock pot meals that you are loving right now down in the comments below so that we can all try out some new yumminess and keep it fun and spicy in the kitchen. If you aren't subscribed, make sure to do that before you leave so you don't miss out on any videos I post here every Tuesday and Thursday. Hope y'all are having an absolutely killer day and I will catch y'all in Tuesday's video.